and I am joined here by General Manager Mike. How are you today? I'm good. How are you guys? Fantastic. We're going to let some people come on in and we're going to take a tour through the facility. Welcome guys. Welcome. So Mike, where are we going first? Everybody, uh, you know, first, second, third, bragging and rice, put it on your Facebook, Instagram, social media. Alright, we'll be back, but we're going upstairs. about 25 feet in there. Sound is a little tough in here, folks. Sorry about that. It's loud. It's arcade. We got go-karts going. We got people bailing. It's bigger than I anticipated. Looking at photos online, there's a lot more than I thought there would be. We are at Supercharged Entertainment and rent them, Mary. I'll just bring over the viewing area first. We are real grassy. How large this building is actually. Yeah. You mind speaking up a little bit? People are having a tough time hearing you. All right, let's take a look over the track. This is a sight to see. Wow, this thing is absolutely huge. So like I said before, this is the largest indoor go-kart track in the world. Uh, I believe uh, General Manager told me 175,000 square feet of track. There are two different tracks and uh, they have two different courses, semi-pro and pro. You can also rent the place out to have the whole track to yourself. Not sure how fast the carts can go. But we'll definitely ask. Mike, how fast can these carts go? They go up to 45 miles an hour. Up to 45, wow. Our pro races and our elite races get up about 40 miles an hour. That's really cool stuff. And then right there, the highest point is about 25 feet in the air. So this is a multi-story track. It just goes up and down and all around. Coming soon, we'll actually connect the tracks for super track. So that'll be racing both tracks at the same time. One large track. People want to know what the prices are for uh, races. So one race is $25. The more races you buy in bulk, the cheaper it gets. We have a three for 65 One race for 25 And soon we'll have more packages. Sounds like a plan. All right, let's go check out this ninja course. How much to rent the place? Oh, I don't know. How do you have a ballpark figure and how much to rent this out? So it depends on if you have track. If you want one track, it's fifteen hundred dollars an hour. Mm -hmm. Sounds good. Mike, you want to count a little bit? The volume good? The volume's good? Yeah, volume's good. So here's our biggest attraction. We got the big red balls. That is probably the hardest thing to actually do here um, because you have to, people trying to bounce on them, you have to run across it. Ah. Uh, almost. But we'll give you a full tour. Yeah. He did say 1500 for a full hour to rent the, uh, the full track out. To make it up, if you want to try the large ball, the call course, you do some one on one action before you try it. If you are waiting for the. Oh! 
best bet is just to run across. People tend to bounce on them. Just go for it. You got to keep that momentum going. Almost, almost. We <laughs> get a lot of big parties, bachelor parties, mm -hmm. big events that just want to do dodgeball. Yeah. This is where all the blood, sweat, and tears are right here. So you can rent out just the dodgeball if you feel like. How much does that go for? Um, that pricing all depends on how many people, what time, and weekend pitching. So you gotta contact our event staff and we'll kind of price it out. Sounds good. Most of our parties, they range from about 10 people all the way to 500 people. Mm -hmm. We adjust it depending on how big you are. If you get some food, you want drinks, you want catered meals, it's all up to whoever wants the party with the catered meals. Yeah. All right, let's keep going. From here, we kind of got the you know, regular trampoline, some kicks and bounce on it. You can practice your backflip, your front flip. Mm -hmm. um, just your generic trampolines. Ooh, off the wall. Yeah. That's a cool one. And over here, this is for smaller, younger kids. So we, it's meant for all ages and heights. So as long as you can walk, there's something here for you to do. So here, obviously, we have a lot of younger kids here. We have a, just a separate section for them, too. Mm -hmm. So just for smaller, younger kids. I did it! So they're nice and safe, they can do everything on their own level, they don't need to worry about other people bumping into them or anything like that. Mm. And up here, it's our giant lava airbag, so you can either jump off into these, bounce uh -huh. into it, or you can do the sideways one, gets you more air. Mm -hmm. over again, you can do that. Gotcha. So, so you've got several small obstacles. So you try to jump on this one, then jump to that, and then get to the other side without falling in. Got the rings, got the net, and then this uh, kind of square ladder system. Good stuff. Is there an age limit to the go-karts? Age limit, you have to be 58 inches tall, and you gotta be 15 years old. So 15 and 58 inches yeah, tall? We will eventually have our double seater carts coming soon. We gotta program them, find the right price, price point for them, but that's coming soon. So double seaters are coming soon. Yep, coming soon. Next few months. Is 15 with or without a parrot? Uh, you need a guardian to sign your waiver the first time, and you're all set. So just a waiver and you're good to go. Yep. All right, let's check out. You're trying to knock the other person off. So you're trying to knock them off the, the beams into the foam pit. Okay. Here is one of our biggest uh, attraction as well. It's the warp wall. Warp, oh, I know the warp wall. So have you ever watched Ninja Warrior? Oh, of course I've watched Ninja Warrior. So we have a smaller one made for, you know, beginners. Yep. We have the larger one that's about 16 and a half feet. I believe Ninja Warrior is 18 feet, or they might have even raised it. We will be eventually getting a taller one mm -hmm. that's going to go in that corner. But right now, this is like the beginner one, and then the advanced. Gotcha. Attention to the number 20 to track two. That's heat number 20 to track two. All right, let's keep going. Oh man, there's more. Every corner you turn, there's more. Up here, you're trying to hold on to the rope. 
wheel as you run across the wall. Oh, you can just swing if you're, that's you know, fantastic. You we got these ladders that move, they're swivels, so they're not just normal ladders, they swivel. So basically what you're telling me is if you want to train for Ninja Warrior, you, you come here because you got, you got the hookup. Yeah, we actually had someone that's a contestant coming up on the new season actually here. The really? Trying to jump back and forth, back and forth while hit, dodging the balls. Uh huh. Same with this, you're just trying to run across this. This makes it very difficult because it all moves. Do you have someone pushing the balls? Yep. Or so okay. Back and forth whenever someone wants to do it, we're moving back. Gotcha. Yep. Attention, supercharged racers. May I please have regular balance beam? Yep. And then we have a balance beam with the balls, makes it a little more difficult. And then you can actually go up the ladder all the way up, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down through the balls. You need to go down the fireman's pole mm -hmm. or through the crisscross all the way down. Ooh, good stuff. So we have a lot of a lot of kids, but we also have a lot of you know fathers and mothers that come here mm -hmm. to do a little more exercise and bond with their families. It's really, really nice. Gotcha. While we're in a little more quiet of a place, uh, what's the price rate for uh, hanging out in the ninja area? So it's eighteen dollars an hour. Eighteen dollars an hour. Yep. Uh, is there also uh, bundles, kind of like the race, where more time? Yep. So right now, I mean, a lot of people they get two hours. They're by the time those two hours are done, they're sweating, they're tired. Uh -huh. So that's really what we offer right now. In the future, we're gonna have a lot more bundles. But gotcha. We do have a racing and jump bundle. That's okay. One of our popular ones too. Yeah. So you get uh, two races and then uh, a three hour, an hour of jump. Mm -hmm. Sounds good. Well, why don't we keep moving? Let's go check out the track again. I guess we can move downstairs. Yeah. See the dodgeball cart, dodgeball court. That's a you know. This is one of our huge attractions because mm -hmm. everybody loves dodgeball.